Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. That stands for the Portable Document Format. And this is a file that is typically created, a document like you would create in a word processor, but then it's saved in such a way that when you view it, it'll look the same way as it did on the computer that it was created on. And more importantly, the file size should be extremely small, hence the portable part of the portable document format. Now to view a PDF, you may need to download software from Adobe. It's free, the Adobe Reader. Make sure you have the latest version because you never know if there have been any security vulnerabilities that have been discovered. Again, it's free. Some people like foxitsoftware.com's Foxit Reader to view their PDFs. And if you have a Macintosh running OS 10, you've got a PDF viewer built right into the operating system, so there's absolutely nothing to download. You can view PDFs, no problem at all. And I'm guessing you've probably got a PDF or two sitting in your inbox, or you've seen a place to download them on the web. A lot of manufacturers create their manuals in PDF form. And uh, there's nothing to worry about as long as you have the latest version of your PDF viewing software. So good luck and enjoy the viewing. We'll see you later.